She's a beaut, huh? The Rojo Light Therapy 3000. Officially, the largest panel I've ever tested and ever used. 600 LEDs, four wavelengths, and nearly six feet tall. So what can I tell you about this panel? First thing, it's from an Australian-based company. They ship locally to Australian and New Zealand citizens, free shipping, taxes, all of that included. Now, if you're watching this from the UK or the USA, don't worry, I've got some good news for you that I'll reveal later on. It's the first time I've actually used a panel that was this tall. Prior to receiving this, the largest panel I've ever tested had 300 LEDs. This is double that. I can see the benefit with such a large panel. It means you can stand right next to it and get your full body treatment. Of course, it's not quite a full shoulder to shoulder width. You would really need two of them side by side to get that. And that may be something one would consider. Not only do we have plenty of LEDs, we've also got Nerofred Pulsing, a nice little control panel, though it does have some flaws. I'll talk about that soon. And it also comes with this neat remote. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is take some measurements and see how much power this thing is putting out. Not only that, I'm gonna see how much power this thing is drawing from the wall. So as you can see here, we've got two nice peaks in the red light range, 630 and 660. But there's still a decent amount of therapeutic light in between those ranges as well. When we look at the near infrared light, we're seeing a little bit of a peak at 830 and then the large peak at 850. So this means you're getting good coverage in both the near infrared and the red light ranges. It's gonna be good for skin health, collagen production, wound healing, muscle recovery, joint pain, all those good things. It is missing out on the 810 nanometer light. So those people who do want the deeper penetrating light may want to look elsewhere. When it comes to the power figures, I do need to be upfront and say, testing a panel of this size was a little bit tricky. I'm not used to having so many LEDs. Keep that in mind as I reveal these numbers. I don't know how accurate they are, but they should give a rough idea of what this panel is capable of. So the peak power reading I had was 100 milliwatts over centimeter squared, which is exceptional. The average power reading was also exceptional at 75.9 milliwatts over centimeter squared. And the total power output across the whole panel was 313 watts. This is massive. Of course, it is twice as large as any other panel. I also plugged in my power meter and I can tell you now this thing is drawing 1,910 watts. So it's not the kind of device you want to leave running in the background if you're not using it. Otherwise, you're going to get quite a large power bill. Hey, really quick, I hope you find value in all these metrics and uh, the testing that I do. It does take me a lot of time. It does cost me a lot of money for some of the devices as well. And be sure to hit the subscribe button as well as I'll be doing this for more products in the future. I then had a quick look at the EMF numbers and the sound levels. EMF was great, no issues there. And the sound came out to be 51 decibels, which is to be expected given the size of this thing. It does have eight fans back there. Okay, so such a large high powered panel is gonna cost a bomb, right? Well, I mean, it does. It is a big panel. There are 600 LEDs in there. But when you actually look at it from a value point of view, it's actually really good. Now this panel retails for 3,295 Australian dollars. Discount code Alex will save you 10% on this panel, which is quite remarkable. That brings the price down below $3,000 Australian. Now converted to US dollars at the time of filming, that works out to be about 2,000 US dollars. Again, quite a remarkable price for a panel that's got 600 LEDs. Now remember, this is an Australian company. However, they do ship out of both New Zealand and Australia. That means if you are an Aussie or a Kiwi, you're going to get this panel in a couple of days, which is great. Not only that, shipping and taxes are also included for us down under. Now, if you are in the States or the UK and you want to get your hands on one of these, what I recommend doing is reaching out to Rojo Light Therapy. I'll put a link to their uh, website below and just tell them, look, this is what you're interested in and this is where you live. And they'll get back to you whether they can do it or not. Anyway, I crunched these numbers and came out with a power value figure. And that figure was $6.40 US. That means you're spending $6.40 to get one watt of therapeutic red light. Now, apart from the Alibaba panel, this is actually the lowest figure I've ever seen, which is quite remarkable given they're a new company and based in Aussie. What about stands and accessories? Well, it does actually come included with this metal wall mounting bracket. Now what's neat is I use one of these brackets on my Biomax 900s. They actually cost $75 if you're ordering them direct from Platinum LED. But this does come included with the panel, which again, adds to the value. The bracket allows you to mount this panel on any wall. There's no chain or pulley system included with the 3000, and that's because of its size. It does come in at 47 pounds, so you're gonna need something solid. Alternatively, Rojo Light offered two stand options, a motorized and a non-motorized stand. I haven't tested their stands, but if they're anything like the Platinum LED stands that I have reviewed before, I'll tell you now that they're a great addition, especially to such a large panel like this. These stands retail for about $1,000 Australian. Finally, Rojo offer a three-year warranty and a 60-day return period. Okay, so what do I like about this panel? Well, 
The obvious thing is its size, right? This is literally a true body panel. It's providing red light treatment from head down to toe, all in one panel. There's no need to connect multiple panels and play around with cables or anything like that. It's all there in one panel. Though ideally, if you wanna go all out, you really need two so you can get that shoulder to shoulder width as well. Though they are a new company, a lot of thought has gone into the product. It looks good, it works well, it's a decent manual and all the right accessories are included. I should also mention, in case you weren't aware of this, Rojo Light Therapy are associated with uh, Sunstream Soreness. That's a company that's been around for over a decade and is very credible with lots of customers internationally. The panel also offers pulsing in the near infrared wavelengths from one hertz to 20 hertz. You can change that on the control panel on the side or of course with the remote. The remote is quite nice to use, but there are some limitations and I'll talk about that soon. Finally, we have price and value. To be honest, if you live in New Zealand or Australia, the options have been quite limited and rather expensive when it comes to getting a panel shipped to your door. That all changes with Rojo. Not only that, you can now get an extremely powerful, rather large panel for an exceptional price. I mean, if you crunch the numbers and compare this to say like a Mitre Red 1500, which looks tiny in comparison, I should add, or some Biomax 900s, you soon realize that this is actually really, really good value. And the fact that it ships locally and taxes and shipping are all included, it's a nice bonus. Okay, so what do I not like about it? Well, let's look at this control panel. Yes, it is better than a lot of its competitors. Yes, it does provide options. You've got the pulsing, you've got the dimming ability. You can disable red light or near for red light, uh, and you can link multiple panels together. All of that is good. However, it's a little bit frustrating to use. You've got to go through lots of options and lots of menus just to do simple things. If you want to increase the time or let's say drop the intensity of in there for it. There's a lot of clicks and a lot of beeps and sometimes I just think there could be a dedicated button for this. Secondly, I don't like the height of the control panel. It should really be eye level. With its current position, you've got to reach around and then look down. The screen is rather small, so not only do you have to crouch down, you got to get up close as well. It's, it's just a little bit frustrating. It, it would be so much better if it was say eight inches higher. The issue that I have with the remote is that it's quite limited in how you use it. Because you change everything through the menus and the buttons on the remote are the same as the buttons on the control panel, you still need to be seeing that screen. So effectively, you don't need the remote. You may as well touch the buttons on the screen. This panel and package is also very, very heavy and quite large. I was lucky that it literally got delivered to my door, but I wouldn't be surprised if some people get a note saying, look, you've got to go down to the local depot to pick it up. If that happens, you then may need to sort a trailer or a van or a ute to pick it up, depending on your car. It is a large box. And like I said, it is quite heavy. I can see why quite a few companies now have decided not to go into these large full panel designs and instead just sell multiple smaller units so you can link them together. Obviously the price point is high, but again, it doesn't mean it's overpriced. In fact, I think it's exceptional value. Finally, the thing that's gonna bother most of you out there is the fact that they're Australian based and they're not offering international shipping. Okay, so who's this panel for? Came up with two users. Firstly is a commercial user uh, wanting a large panel, easy to use. Maybe you get two of them or maybe you get a stand, use it in a clinic or a gym. Secondly, anyone in New Zealand or Australia that is keen for a premium, well-built, large red light therapy panel from a local company. I mean, that's the obvious market. Okay, so what other panels should you consider whether you're in New Zealand or overseas? Well, there's actually quite a few options because you can always get the smaller panels and link them together. Most red light therapy companies sell them as packages. One example is Mitre Red. You could get their Mitre Pro 1500 and the Mitre Pro 750. That's gonna give you a similar height, but it's actually a lot narrower and you're only getting 450 LEDs with that setup. They do provide free shipping to America though, and that setup would come in at about $1,600 after using discount code Alex. Mitre Red also do a commercial range. So their Mitre Red Mega has 600 LEDs, just like this one. It's a little bit shorter than the Rojo 3000, but it's wider at the same time and it will come in around $2,300. Next up, you could get two Biomax 900s, free shipping in America, 600 LEDs total. The upside is you're getting two more wavelengths. You're getting 810 nanometer light plus blue light, which the Rojo doesn't have. You are also getting a slightly wider panel, but you're gonna end up with a big uh, weak spot through the middle. But if all of this is just a pipe dream and you're watching this just to drool over such a large panel, you might wanna check out some of the smaller options. I've got a really good review of the Rojo Therapy 300. I'll put that up here. It has all the great features that its big brother has at a much lower price point. Otherwise, if you've got any questions, please leave them below. I'll do my best to get back to you. All right, guys, bye.